I do so swear. He ready. How do you spell Brian Kane? B R I A N C A I N. So, like the inventor of murder, not the walking instrument. Correct. Where is your brother Abel? I'm not his keeper. He gone. He gone. B. Are you related to Abel? No. Louise Kane? Louise Kane, yes. How about Kane West, that guy that got benched for Pete Davidson? No. What B. about Kane from WWE? Not that I know of. How does it feel to be associated with the inventor of murder? Sometimes it's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> you matriculated at the University of Texas in Austin, true? That's right. What was your major? History and religious studies, mm. double major. What was your second favorite religion? Second favorite religion? Second favorite. Buddhism second was favorite. pretty cool to study. Okay. Uh, how about the worst? Um, like uh, the biggest heathens. Who's going straight to hell? Hmm. Yeah, that's a tough one. Worst religion. Okay. Have you ever played Objection Mortal Kombat? Yeah. <laughs> you have ever I played, played Mortal Kombat? Mortal Kombat. Yes, yes, Pretend have. like there's a, re a religious leader's edition and pick your character. Pick my... Oh, well. Buddha would be pretty cool. Liu Kang. Billy Graham. He I'm did all those crusades. Satan. <laughs> Paula. You almost became an Episcopal priest, yes? That's right. May the Lord be with you. And also with you. And mm -hmm. with you. It, it's... Ahead, Episcopalians Paul, are like vegetarians, but they add fish, right? <laughs> yeah, we can eat fish. Or is it no fish? No, it's where you only eat fish. Is that like Methodists or Lutherans? We really don't have any dietary restrictions. Is that like Methodists or Lutherans? Closer to Lutherans, but Methodists is pretty close. That's to. even worse. It's not as bad as Catholics, though. No. Yeah. <laughs> now you're getting criminals off and helping dads avoid child support. Good choice. Good choice. Good, good. You sing in choir at Trinity Episcopal. Do you ever solo? No. <laughs> Can you make like a cantor and sing sing us a line from the liturgy? The no. liturgy. Liturgy. Amen. Ah, ah, it's like the Halo theme song. After UT, you went to Texas State, and your resume notes a 3.67 GPA. Ooh. That's impressive. Yeah. It's a 4.0 if you round up. But then at Seton Hall, you plummeted to a 3.1. What happened? Law school's tough, man. That's a total frat move. Did you have a bunch of wicked smart chicks in your classes? Hey, New York, you? New York's got some, you know, you got Broadway, you got, I mean, you got a lot of distractions Distractions. In New York. You also worked for a senator in New Jersey, Robert Menendez, where you researched issues and recommended solutions. solutions. What was your best? What was your best solution? My best solution, uh, I, I, being in the Republican and a Democrat's office, I recommended that he look into things that Tom DeLay uh, had suggested and uh, got a, got a weird look. But, you know, I thought, it was a good I thought it was a good solution. Any uh, world Bing. changers or just like Charmin for the bathrooms? Um, <laughs> it was it was small stuff. You also liaised with governmental officials, right? Occasionally. And when you liaised, are you laying down or is that like standing up? Some Sounds like both. laying some down, both, some liaised. Some of both. Okay. Shout out your kids, names and ages. Abigail's nine, Eleanor's five. Who's your favorite? <laughs> We know no. it's Eleanor based upon what you said earlier, yeah. so it's okay. And who's mom? Catherine. Katie. She likes Katie. I I call her Catherine. So you do know who the mom is? I, I'm aware, yeah. So she gave a curious speech at Honor Cafe, and, and she led with, I'm not good at public speaking, and then she totally forgot her speech. So the question is, why did you bat her lead off? <laughs> <laughs> she was... She was confident that she had it all down. Were you punishing her for the Beto pick? Yeah. The AKA Robert the, Francis or the Beto the pick. Third? Beethoven, uh, he realized he needs guns to take our guns, so he's converted to a Republican. That's good. What, why does he sweat so much, though? Yeah. His floppy pelt makes him top heavy. <laughs> he sweats, he needs a mop and bucket. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of good natured floppy pelts, you've got a nice hound dog pelt. Have you ever received a permanent? No. What kind of hair product do you use? Whatever's cheapest. Have you ever rocked just a mustache, a little bristle brush? Nope. Street sweeper. Do you wear short shorts to the gym? No. Ever lift? Do you even lift, bro? Yeah. I've got a, a home set. I just haven't been doing it in the last se several months. Ah, how much do you bench? I've gotten up to 225 at one point. boy. So, in spirit of the New Jersey, this Halloween, will you go as David Hasselhoff from Baywatch? I, I'll consider you'd good, it. You'd be a good Hoff. How about Billy Graham? That'll be a good one, too. What about Beto? No. <laughs> Do you have a will? I, I've had enough of him. So that's for sure. Do you have a will? Do I, I have a will. Prenup? No. How much money to retire? Oh, way more than I have now. Fair What's enough. the most humble job you've ever had? I 
my first job was at Taco Bell. How, do you, how often do you check social media? Well, since the campaign started every day. Mm-hmm. And what apps do you use? Facebook. And are you posting, commenting, or just trolling? I post. I actually, I think I've made two posts today. Have you cried in the last year? Not audibly. Whoa. Sum up your life philosophy in a word or phrase. A word or phrase? Life Hmm. philosophy. Hmm. I'm a little bit go along to get along at times. Okay. What's one thing people don't know about you that you want them to? Yeah, that one's out of left field. Um, Fun fact about Brian Kane. If I could watch football at any time, I would. Nice. You know what your problem is? No. Okay, just asking. Okay. (laughs) As a private attorney, how many cases have you tried? Yeah, how many criminals have you gotten off? Actually, none have been found not guilty. I've just done better than the wreck. It was what, you know, it's kind of, if it's a felony, that's what you're looking for as a a minimum. Uh, But but no, 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 not guilty, so. Which candidate in the primary spends the most time in the mirror? (laughs) I'm going to guess Huffines. Okay, and who's the least? Dan McCon. <laughs> What's the meanest thing you've said into a microphone, either in court or on the campaign trail? Into a microphone. Meanest oh, well, thing. Um, I accidentally uh, had a client who was, he was getting in my ear because he screwed up and didn't get all the documents to me. No context, I, just yeah. say it. Say the uh, mean thing. F off. <laughs> That's Paula. mean. So, judicial fashion is painfully outdated. Would yeah. you agree? Ro- I'm Dude. sorry. Judicial, judicial fashion. fashion. Painfully oh. outdated. Robes are so last season. If you could give it an update, what would you wear as a judge? Update uh, the robe. I'm a traditionalist. I like it. I'm going with the robe. If you could be anything other than a lawyer or a judge, what would you be? First baseman for the Astros. Atta boy. What's your top unchecked bucket list item? Being first baseman for the Astros. <laughs> Fastest you've ever gone in a car. 115. Favorite mm-hmm. lawyer movie or show? Oh, my cousin Benny. Come Fav- on. Yeah, that's a good one. Favorite place you've ever been? London. Hmm. Paula. What's your favorite? Uh, who's your favorite person in the office? In office. Who's your favorite elected official? Oh, in office. My favorite elected official. I, I like the way that... Uh, I like the way DeSantis is rolling right now. Santos. And the least favorite? Say it. Wow. Who do you can't stand? Say it. Biden. Yeah. Come on. Favorite color? Blue. Number. Six. Food? Pizza. Song. Oh, so many. Probably something from the old 97s. Bible verse. I. I kind of quoted it earlier. I'm, I'm not my brother's keeper. Which okay. Is, actually, I was using it in the the opposite of its intention. <laughs> Who's smarter, you or your wife? She is. You or Dennis Watson? Hmm. Dennis Watson's pretty smart, so I, I'm not going to back off that one. You or your opponent? Hmm, I haven't gotten to know him that well to know he, how smart he is. He's the, pretty smart, though. The voters will decide. Objection, unresponsive. 100-yard dash, you versus safely. Show the camera your most intimidating hair flip <laughs> for the pre-race face-off. <laughs> nice. Very intimidating. What's a better pet, a rat or a bat? Bat. Would you rather be stoned to death by Willie Nelson or hung by a jury of your peers? Not stoned with, <laughs> not stoned with Willie, stoned by Willie. Love Willie, so anything with Willie is going to be the answer. Rusty nice. Harden or Tony Busby? Oh, man, I've seen Rusty in action. Rusty. Good choice. So why does Deshaun Watson need 40 different masseuses? <laughs> I guess they all hit him in a different way. Yeah. How does the Deshaun Watson saga end? Has he had his last happy ending in Houston? Uh, well, he might come to town as a visitor. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll beat him. Did you love the hot seat? That was fun. Atta boy. Good job, Brian Kane. Atta boy.